Hi, my beautiful family, and welcome to my video. Today, I'm going to review three new lipsticks that uh, L'Oreal just released for the holidays 2018, and they're all so cute. I'm going to swatch them on my hands, on my lips, and show you how they look. So if you're interested to see that, then please keep on watching. Okay guys, so first of all I just want to say that on my eyes I do have this palette in my crease, some of the shades and also all over my eyelid I do have my new Prism Metal Chromus Eyeshadow Houdini from JCAT. I love these and I just received an email from Coco Panda, the website where I ordered all of these. That, that they are going to send me the two shades that were missing in my package and I'm so excited, it was so so nice and they already have sent them to me so can't wait to receive those two and I'm definitely going to swatch them on my channel because I love them. I know they've been out for, for a long time but they just came to Sweden and I'm very excited to wear them. As you can see they're all so beautiful, love love these, so easy. Two shades from this palette, one on my eyelid, um, the makeup look looks stunning. But we're not here for that. I just wanted to share Coco Panda, they're all so nice, I ordered so many things from them. They are the best. It's so easy to come in contact with the custom service and they are always so nice. And yeah, can't wait to receive my two shades. Okay, so look at this packaging look how beautiful it looks stars everywhere i just hate that this sticker i really really hate it because it just destroys the packaging and i also removed it from one of the lipsticks and it wasn't a good idea because it feels sticky on that side but you can see the shade down here and look at this can you see beautiful stars? I'm so excited to try these. I really, really like L'Oreal's lipsticks. And I'm going to start. There are three shades. There is one that I just showed you. And there is one red and also a nude. So I'm going to start with nude and red. And this one is going to be the least. And let's start. The first shade is color. It's 259 Nude After Party. I don't know if you can see the stars, but they are so cute. Let me swatch it on my hand. Take it down, we don't want to break it. Oh, that's kind of um, like orangey nude shade. And it looks like it has some gold shimmer. Doesn't look like that here. It has some gold, gold shimmer. I think it looks beautiful. I want to zoom in. So I did zoom you in a little bit just so you can uh, so you can see the shades. And I need my mirror. So let's try this on the lips. Oh, creamy. Such a beautiful nude. And I, and I love lipsticks, they are creamy when it's wintery cold outside because my lips get very, very dry and I kind of prefer this kind of creamy formula on my lips, but it feels very light and I think it looks stunning. So this was Nude After Party 259 shade. I think it goes very well with my eye look. I love it. Yeah, it's shimmery, but it's not too much. Just enough shimmer. Really, really like it. Love this color. And these are easy to remove, so they are not smudge proof. Oh. So go to the next shade. We're going to try the red one. This one is beautiful. It looks like more orangey red shade. Let's watch it. It's a beautiful red. 
let's try it on the lips. This was a very terrible swatch. Definitely need um, a lip pen. But guys, the shade is so pretty. Also has gold shimmer. It's creamy, but not too creamy. It doesn't feel like it's going to go everywhere. You know, sometimes the red lipsticks, when you they're creamy, you put them on the lips and you kind of go around and or scared that it's going to go everywhere. I don't have that feeling with this lipstick. I think also goes very well with the makeup look. Feels like this gold sparkle goes together with the eyeshadow that I have on my eyelids. But I really, really like this shade. It's so pretty. So this was, I did a 393 Paris Burning. Paris Burning shade. Beautiful shade. Like orangey red. No. I hate removing red lipstick. The glitter is still there. I can say it's not that easy to remove this. Let's go in with the last shade. And it's 488 Close at Night. Close at Night. And it's this beautiful purple shade. This last shade has also some shimmer in it, but it looks like it's more uh, more at that silvery kind of shimmer. These two have more gold, but this one is definitely more silver shimmer, but it's not too much. Let's try it on the lips. Mm, so creamy. So definitely overdrew my lips a little bit too much, but this one is more metallic looking. It feels like, kind of reminds me of that new Huda Beauty lipstick, uh, the metallic shade, I don't know what it's called, but it looks like that. Maybe not as metallic as that one, but definitely more shimmery than the other two. Or I feel like it, I don't know. Let me know down below what do you think when you see them on camera, but in real life, these two are shimmery, but not as much as this one. This one turns out to be more metallic looking, but I like it. I really, really like this shade. I don't know, it doesn't go with the makeup look, but my God, this is a beautiful, beautiful shade. shade. Definitely something I'm going to wear. I don't care if it's, it's if it suits me or not, because I really think my lips are pretty in this shade. Doesn't go with the lipstick. Uh, not lips, but doesn't go with the makeup look, but really, really like this shade. So this was uh, close at night. So guys, that's all of the three shades new from L'Oreal. And I love all of the shades. I think they're beautiful. I don't have anything that kind of reminds me of these shades. So that's very good. Please let me know down below. What's your favorite L'Oreal lipstick? And uh, if you don't have a favorite L'Oreal lipstick, what's lipstick? What's your favorite lipstick to wear during the holidays? I would really like to know. And thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to, to subscribe if you already haven't and be part of Diddy family. I love you all so much. Thank you for watching and see you in my next video. Bye. So forget what I said that it's easy to remove these. I have glitter everywhere. It looks pretty though like a Christmas tree.